Okay, so on to the next track in what is has panned out to be quite a heavy series to start with. I'm not sure where we're going now. Um, but this is Sonia's Young Soul Saturdays. I, I really appreciate the music, appreciate the messages, and I, I'm all for uh, this kind of thing, but it is a bit heavy. Um, the last two is a bit heavy. So if you're in a, 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 like a good mood today, um, maybe just wait. <laughs> or just watch it, whatever. Go back to and, uh, um, and start watching from Steve, uh, Stephen Wilson and then move on to Moncrief. Both beautiful, beautiful songs. And we talk uh, quite a bit there. So yeah, completely up to you. This one over here is Woodkid, I Love You Quintet version. Uh, never heard of this artist, never heard of this song. The message over here from uh, Sonia is Yon Lemoyne, uh, known, uh, hopefully I didn't butcher that, uh, Yoan Lemoyne, known professionally as Woodkid, is a French music video director, graphic designer and singer, songwriter. His most notable works includes music video directed by Katy Perry's Teenage Dream, Taylor Swift's Back to December, Lana Del Rey's Born to Die, Harry Styles, Sign of the Times. Oh my God, these are all heavy hitters, man. <laughs> Jesus, okay. So he's worked with the beasts in the industry. Um, yeah, before we even get into that, for those of you who want to book a uh, Monarchy of Queens uh, uh, campaign, you can with the other reactors, link are all down in the description. Uh, you can do it with Wolf, Magnify or Alex. Unfortunately, I will not be partaking in that. I want to finish all of the HOHs by Wednesday next week and then do the 535 um, um, awards videos. And then I'm going to be launching my own personal uh, series, which is has only got 10 booking slots and it's a very unique limited edition series that's going to be absolutely fantastic i've spoken about it in all my other videos so uh, let me not chew your ear on that let's just get straight into it wood kid i love you quintet version let's see what we got never heard of this let's go Offshore through the tides of oceans, we are shining in the rising sun. As we are floating in the blue, I am softly watching you. Oh boy, your eyes betray what burns inside you. Whatever I feel for you You only seem to care about you Is there any chance you could see me too? Cause I love you Is there anything else? Well, I like the line specifically where he says Your eyes are betraying what you feel and what, what you feel inside you essentially Right, so it's kind of like she looks at him in a certain way, but doesn't feel about him in that way as well. So it literally, the eyes and the and the heart are in conflict over here, right? And he's sort of like pleading to her to sort of at least have that somewhat align, so that she could actually see him for who she is, right? So that the eyes don't lie. It's either either the eyes are lying to her or the heart is lying to the eyes. Essentially, either one uh, way around it. It's just not. It's just. She's not seeing him for who he is, which is absolutely devastating him because he, his eyes and his heart align. You know what I mean? Um, so he desperately wants to be seen. Carry on. Cause I love you. Is there anything I could do just to get some attention from you? In the ways I've lost every trace of you. Where are you? After all I drifted ashore Through the streams of oceans We spurs wasted in the sand As we were dancing in the blue I was synchronized with you But now the sound of love is out of tune Sonia, what's going on today, man? Jeez, you're trying to like... 
<laughs> you try to make my Saturday gloomy. Oh my gosh, seriously? Look, they're beautiful pieces of music, right? But this is like the third heavy one, which I'm all for, man. I'm all for. I'm, I'm not uh, um, one of those people that can't handle my emotions. I can handle my emotions. And I really like songs like this because it's very uh, um, um, reflective, essentially. You know, you tend to look at the... You know, these are the kind of songs that, that make you think and tend to... You look at your own life, you look at the things around you and stuff like that. Um, and also you look at your past and you, you, you know, it's the, it can offer a sense of of gratitude or it can offer a sense of regret whatever it is for the different individual this kind of music is always very important but uh yeah i mean um i don't know maybe hopefully for others let's see if we can uh, um sort of uh, maybe the the music will start getting a little bit more cheerful but uh either way it's great great pieces of music i've liked them all so far start off cheer. whatever i feel for you I love the way where it's almost submissive to a sense with the way he says that. It's not like, you know, I wish you would see me too. He's literally like almost asking in a very submissive, vulnerable way. Is there any chance? Is there any? It's almost like he feels like there isn't. But that, that, is there, that, that beginning part, is there any chance that you can see me too, right? It's such a heart-wrenching uh, um, line because it almost feels like there isn't and he knows it. Do you know what I mean? And it's almost like a, a, a cry, um, um, almost pleading in a way, but not being so direct with that and not being sort of aggressive and sort of too forward about it. It's almost... It comes from such a vulnerable space in the sense is like he, he's trying to be so modest and there's no fake modesty about it at all. It's just he's trying to be so modest uh, um, about it where even in that, in asking her to love him, he's trying to do it in the most res which in the most respectful way possible, right? Because that is how much um, um, respect and adoration he has for her. Do you know what I mean? So it speaks a lot to... Um, his his kind of disposition. Is there anything I could do just to get some attention from you in the way that lost every trace of you? absolutely incredible not, not not that i'm surprised by it given the heavy hitters that he's worked with he's obviously quality right and i mean this is uh, a pointing case but 
You guys let me know what you think down below and uh, I'll catch you on the very next one. Peace.